What's going on everybody? Thank you for tuning in to Shooting Gallery New England today. Today we're going over another holster. We're going over the Eclipse Delta Wing IWB holster Kydex with the wing. Let's get down to the tabletop and go over some features and we actually got some range footage in this one. So stay tuned and we're going to get down to the tabletop. And welcome back everybody. How is everybody doing? We're at the tabletop. Sorry if I just kicked the camera. So today we are going over the Glock 19 holster, the Delta holster from Eclipse Holsters. Obviously, Eclipse Holsters is kind of very space oriented. They're very highly into space. We had Jess, one of the owners from Eclipse Holsters on the podcast. Link's gonna be somewhere around here in a card. But so this guys is my EDC. I also have one of their mag carriers. This is built for the, so I carry on the right side, right-handed. So this is gonna be obviously on the right hand as well. They have two different sizes. The good thing about Eclipse Holsters guys, it is affordable. They are American made, all made in house. And one of the good things about this holster guys is it has a maybe, I think right now they're still running, advertising on their website, a three day, three to five day lead time. So you're not, and that's including shipping. So it's not like you're gonna be waiting months to get a holster. They get it out to you, they have it all in house, they get the prints ready, they're awesome. Now, one thing I do like, I'm gonna actually have some range footage rolling in after this clip so you can see this holster in action. Now, this being my EDC, but first, since we have a handgun present, let's just make sure. Magazine's out of the gun, nothing's in the mag, and there's nothing in the chamber, so the gun is clear. So, this is my Glock 19. As Jess said on the podcast, if, they're, if you're a holster company and you're not making a Glock 19 holster, you're doing something wrong. <laughs> Everyone wants the Glock 19. So, obviously, they got these cool prints. This one is the Cryptek. Yeah, Cryptech Neptune. I can't say Cryptech ever, like properly. I always have to like re-say what I'm trying to talk about. But this is a Cryptech Neptune pattern. I chose to go with the lime green rivets and then obviously you can choose the back pattern. It's all customizable on the website. If I knew how to do some super cool technical website screen share on the thing, on the video, I'd tell you, but I don't. Um, so, the good thing about the Delta holster is it comes with the Delta wing named after the NASA space shuttle, the Delta. Um, what this does is it pushes the clothing away. So again, this is an unloaded gun. One of the other things I'm really liking about this holster is that it has the clickable retention. It's amazing. It doesn't fall out. As the last one of the last holster videos I did on the BBF make for my Glock 20, I went like this, and I'm a rather large man with a question, you know, rather large arms. I'm really shaking this thing. This is not coming out at all, all right? But when I'm ready, I can get a firm grip, and there you go, and easy peasy lemon squeezy. But what the Delta Wing does though, when you this is in the waistband, this pushes against the belt, and it is able to conceal it better to the inside of your pants so it's easier. So say you want to carry like a full size handgun with this delta wing, it's gonna help you. Now, the side, I, well, I don't know what they call them, side rider or side car. This isn't technically a side car, it's not connected, but a spare mag holster. The only thing that this, it's the same pattern to match it. There's two, they have multiple uh, sizes where I think it's the one inch and the 1.75 inch clips. Uh, I also went with the lime green rivets on this to match the regular holster. The only thing with the mag is maybe this different on other, other mag holders that they have or magazine holsters that they sell. I only have, you know, one of one. So this is my experience with it. Awesome, same thing. It's not going anywhere. The only down, downside, or some people not, you know, consider this a downside. There's no clickable retention. It's just, like, you can kind of have a click, but again, the retention is rock solid. They're able to adjust. They use Phillips head screws on the holster itself and the mag holster. 
Now, guys, now we got all the specs out of the way, before I do get we get to the range footage and close this video out, I do want to remind you that they have a lifetime warranty on this. So say you're a little bit rough on your gear <laughs> and you break a clip or you, you know, the wing comes undone and this part comes off. 100% lifetime warranty. That is key when it comes to your whole of gear, guys. You get a lifetime warranty. They're right out of Virginia. They are amazing holsters. Right about now, I think they're running like $74 for this. Obviously, when you add different prints and the wing, it's like, I think it's like an extra $5 to add the Delta wing to the Delta holster. Uh, it's, but it, they're, so it comes out to like maybe 80 bucks and that's in line with a lot of competitive brands, but also they're American made. They stand by their product and they have some cool prints, guys. They got stuff like Stormtroopers, Sugar candy skulls like the Day of the Dead skulls. They got Baby Yoda. They got pinup girl mermaids. They come out with all different types. It's not just in the waistband. They have out of the waistband. They have light bearing. They and they cover all the main brands like the Surefire, the Streamlight. They do got the Old Light. So they cover all their bases pretty much on Glocks. But they also have it for M and P's, Rugers. They only do J Frame Smith and Wesson revolvers for you revolver guys out there. But they have a holster for literally anybody that's looking to carry so let's get to the range footage i'll show you how these holsters are working and after that i'll give you my final opinion on it so let's get to the range right about now all right guys like you can tell like i said before in the uh when we were at the tabletop this eclipse delta wing holster covers very well on my body yes i do am a firm believer of knowing what gun you want to carry for appendix i just tend to carry appendix because that's how i like to carry and it's most comfortable for me but as you can tell you cannot tell the delta the delta wing itself is doing a great job now yes i have said before like i said in the beginning of the video the clock 19 is very uncomfortable for me to carry but i'm learning to kind of cope with it maybe i can get into like a m and try that out for carry for a nine millimeter. I do carry the, the Glock 19 for my work because that's why I'm an armed guard now. So I have to carry a firearm for work. So I'm gonna do a couple draws. I'm not gonna do like a quick, quick draw because my gun club does not allow me to do that. It's more of just demonstrating how to, I, you know, reach my firearm and I have a spare mag. I got a couple magazines loaded, so we'll do it a couple times, okay? So say someone's coming at me, Oh my god, something's coming at me. Draw. Then I got the spare mag carry as well. So technically, you know, 20 rounds in the target, you know, it's not the best accuracy. I'm gonna have a video coming up soon that kind of has a Glock 19 revisited. I kind of have, I got the ball ammo at least, the 115 grain ball ammo that I have decent accuracy with for target practice and stuff like that. I'm gonna have a video kind of depicting that. So let's uh, redo this and see how it works, all right? So one thing I did change is I made sure I did put something in the chamber this time because that's how a lot of people carry. Again, you're going to hate me in the comments. I actually don't carry one in the chamber. That's just how I like to train myself. But I'm trying something a little bit different so you guys don't completely bury me in the comments because I know you're going to be like, oh, dude, you had to just totally like rack your slide when you draw on that. Okay, so again, relax, guys. It's okay. Just calm it down. It's just a YouTube video, <laughs> but thank you guys for watching, by the way. Before we close this video out, I'm going to uh, demonstrate how to use the Eclipse Delta Wing holster, and I have a mag carrier as well. And again, guys, I'm a pretty fat guy. I got some love handles, so I can get away with carrying a bigger gun. If I'd like, I'd like to try the Glock 20 on the Delta Wing holster, uh, just because that's more of a gun I'm 
common to carry a lot actually more than my Glock 19 it's funny when I come home from work I take the Glock 19 out of my out the waistband holster which is a chi tac I'll have a review coming on that at some point and still trying it out not that big a fan of it but I'll throw the Glock 20 back on but now I definitely know that I got to get a Glock 20 holster from Eclipse might try out something else because they got a ton of holsters guys the link to their website is going to be in the description below i just have them on the shooting with podcast so that means i'll have a card probably right around here listen to that that's a big ass helicopter flying over so sorry about that add guys but yeah jess over at eclipse holsters she's a wonderful woman extremely nice funny makes a ton of great products all that stuff you can find on her website definitely check out the garage sales section because you can get actually cheaper holsters from them trying when they try and test out new holsters on new guns what they'll do is they'll say hey what do you guys think of this design for their website and they'll throw it in the garage sale at a discounted price so definitely check that out too you get pretty sweet holsters so without me talking before we close this video out let's try this again <laughs> all right so oh my god someone's trying to kill me Well guys, let's close this video out, get back to the tabletop. All right guys, so before we end this video, I forgot to mention we got some savings for you. So, you just saw all the range footage on how to use the Delta holster from Eclipse Holsters. Now, because Eclipse Holsters rocks and me and them get along very well, we are passing the savings on to you. I am making this abundantly clear. I am making no money from this, but since you all rock, we're getting to, we're 350 subscribers right now, which is awesome. Now, if you use the code SGNE in the screen, and it's gonna be on the screen right here to get a holster like this or any other type of holster that Eclipse Holsters offers, you're gonna get 15% off if you use the code SGNE. Thank you again to Eclipse Holsters for giving this back to you. I received no money or kickbacks from this code. It's just to give back to you viewers here. Let's get back to the end of the video, okay? All right, guys. So, we appreciate you swinging by for today's holster review. Like I said, I gotta stress enough that I am not sponsored by Eclipse. It's just, this has been my EDC everyday carry when I'm carrying. The Glock 19 mags empty, like I said before, and it is nothing in the chamber. See, it's clear. So, like I said, clips holsters, we get this back, and we're back going all around today. The Delta Wing is a very comfortable holster. Yes, I do have my reservations about the squareness of the Glock 19 itself. When it comes to the wing, the sweat guard is not that obtrusive. Yes, I have a little bit of uh, love handles to deal with, but any guy that's going to be a little bit overweight or, you know, anybody that's overweight is going to have a little bit of issue with that. But, slam dunk, all-star holster right here. So, please check out some Eclipse holsters in the link below. I left the link to the website, their social media, like their Instagram and their Facebook. Check them out. Let them know I sent you because again, they're nice people. We had them on the podcast. That episode's gonna be linked in the description below and probably floating in the car at some point over here. But guys, thank you so much for joining today and I will see you soon. Stay shooting and stay tuned.